Excuse me, I was hoping you had a room at your rather rustic looking inn. Ugh, he is. Me a neved. Bessers Majoru? Of course, my English friend. We have many rooms available to you. How long will you be staying with us? Probably just the night. I have to make it to Castle Dracula in the morning, and... <gasps> I, I'm sorry, did I say something wrong? No, no, my friend. Now, will it just be you staying with us, or do you have any traveling companions? Just me, I'm afraid. I had a coachman, but he muttered something about this land being cursed, and turned around and left me here. Superstition. This land isn't cursed at all. We are a quaint village with many shops and gazebos. It's not as if our cows have stopped giving milk and the last child born in this village had the hooves instead of feet. Well, that's good to hear. Budesh kuchar, mengele pokoba, a kurva anyad, baz mega picha te rohat. I'm sorry, what did she say? She hopes that you will stay longer and take in some of our local restaurants and nightlife. We have a festival now. It is a potato festival. You really should come. Thank you, no. I must say, though, that the local hospitality has been most pleasant. Thank you, my friend. We appreciate the kind words and the business. You know, everyone told me that this part of Europe was filled with backward superstition and old wives' tales. Outside of dressing like organ grinders, this place is almost just like England. Oh my god, that man has raccoons for hands. What? I don't see anything. That man, over there, he has live raccoons for hands. How is that even possible? A leg parnash hajum van angle naka. Oh, he's my brother. And those aren't raccoons, those are... Raccoon-themed mittens, which you can purchase in our local gift shop. No, those are clearly live raccoons, melded to his hands. What sort of sheep blanket medieval hellhole do you inhabit, sir? Hold on a fuck on Please, sir, we are a struggling community. We can't afford to lose business. My brother's hands are raccoons, for fuck's sake. I beg you, stay with us. We will prepare for you to have the best room in the house and a hot meal of the most wonderful potato and cabbage stew. You know, I haven't had a good cabbage and potato stew since I was a boy. The woman who raised me was Irish, you see. Indentured servant, lovely woman, drinking problem. You have yourself a deal, sir. How do you say in England? Uh, a jolly good. <laughs> Indeed. Are the walls bleeding? Of course, my friend. It is Thursday. Charming. 